Okay, Aquarius, it's your girl Dominique with Empathic Guidance, and I'm back with another video for you guys today. And today I'm back with a message on what is it about you that triggers others, okay? So what is it about your personality, your character traits, your overall presence that may trigger those around you, whether this is love, interests, friends, co-workers, family members, neighbors, it doesn't matter. This is not just conducive to uh, love alone, okay? why? What about you triggers people? Okay, y'all. Okay, so what triggers people about you is that you are very methodical. You guys may be very just tapped in and in tune with your logical your logic rather than your emotions because you're kind of coming up as the king of swords here all right so you guys are very intellectual so i feel like it's your intellect that really triggers people maybe it make people feel small maybe it feel make people feel dumb maybe it made people feel like you a know it all which everybody always say about aquarius anyways but i feel like you're very sharp with your communication and then you know how to be detached too you could be very stoic and not like overly emotional about everything that's happening in your life and it may give people the persona that you just don't give a fuck about them okay so yeah you guys are very independent so it's like when it's time for certain things to fly away you see how she holding that cloth loosely in her hand she not grasping it clasping it clinging on to it it's like you let things fly in the wind you good on your own you got most of you guys are doing very well for yourself financially so uh, that also triggers people because a lot of people feel are a lot of people are used to codependency and because you are not and you more on an independent wavelength aquarius it just make people feel unneeded you know so one one thing is how smart you are another thing you know what I'm saying? It's how independent you are. It just makes people feel pushed away and pushed down. And so if you've been experiencing a lot of people feeling triggered by your presence, it's probably because you have a strong presence and, you know, people just may feel like you just cold, stoic, cut off. And, you know, people may even consider you a mean guy or a mean girl because this is the king of swords, but a lot of the feminine energy um, I just feel like, uh, air is a masculine energy, period. So, a lot of the feminine energies that are Aquarius, Libra, and Gemini, I feel like we also embody, uh, a vast amount of our masculine energy, even if we really feminine, you know? So, let's see. I feel like you guys can be very secretive, um, possibly at this time as well. People don't like that. They may be, like, looking to social media to try to find out more about you or, cut through the mystery or whatever it is that you haven't been talking to them about okay but they may be finding very little yeah and then it's like you avoid conflict it's like certain people may feel so triggered that they may come after you because of that but it's like you're not competing with nobody you're not arguing back it's just you know you going with the flow and you go with the wind you're very free spirited just like she's being shown here and that's the reason why you grant it. Like, that's the reason why you get so much favor from the divine because you avoid the nastiness. Like, people may come for you. They may, may be trying to come for the jugular. And you like, okay, you know what I'm saying? Like, okay, why you drinking my blood? Pour me a cup. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, it's just, I don't know. It, people just don't like that. They don't like that. When they try to get to you in some kind of way, you don't show the emotion behind it, okay? The Three of Wands in reverse and the Lover's card here, you don't wait for people either, you know, okay? So, you may have had people in your life that, you know, they had to make a choice between you and others. And you don't wait, you know what I'm saying? Like, whenever you the type of person, Aquarius, whether you a man or a woman, that if basically if somebody got to choose between you and somebody else, you be like, choose them, you know what I'm saying? Like... So, that's what people don't like. It's like you don't need nobody. So, they can't trigger you by silent treat, treating you, trying to make you jealous, trying to choose somebody else over you. It's like, okay, you know, you recognize the higher, you, you think more with your mind. You already probably have humanity and people and their behaviors down pat. So, you just already know. Like, if somebody got to choose between you and somebody else and they having a hard time making up their mind, that they probably not for you because anybody that's for you is going to really see you how you need to be seen and not as competition, you know? It's like, these it's people out here that's in one side of competitions with you, Aquarius, and they don't like that because they want you to catch on to the fact like, hello, can't you feel that I'm competing with you? Uh, can't you feel that I'm sending you subliminal messages? Can't you tell that I'm hating on you? Hello, hate back, do something. Like, they, these people be trying to get more of a reaction than that cold, stoic, 
poker face of a king of a king of uh source energy using your intellect and your knowledge rather than you know stupidity and ignorance to get get over people yeah it's like people be want to resurrect shit and you be putting a nail in the coffin you know so you kind of like aries in this sense where it's some when something dead is dead and people be wanting you to wait on them i'm getting that you know yeah healing heart it's like you work on healing your heart. You free yourself from toxic people. And so once again, I'm getting the whole energy of, you know, he thinks she, he think he better than us. She thinks she better than us. A lot of y'all, the people that y'all trigger, y'all was meant to trigger anyway, because it was karmic connections. So whoever these people are, they was meant to learn these things from you. Instead of hate, try love. Instead of dark, try light. Instead of, you know, always getting in your feelings and doing stuff you know, that you're going to end up regretting later, think about it first. You know what I'm saying? So it's like all of your intellect and knowledge and, you know, your way of operating and avoiding catastrophes in your life is teaching these people that it's the better way to go because these people are falling on their own sword, so to speak, okay? So hopefully that helps somebody, Aquarius. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Join the Soul Tribe over on my YouTube channel. The icon is in the bio. And follow me on Instagram at Dominique Valentine. And I'll check you guys out on the next one. Peace.